Judy and Lois, I just have to tell you right now, it's a super treat for me to speak with you both today. Lois, congratulations on the Tony a nomination. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. That is just so it's remarkable. A it's a nomination, not a Tony. Well, I'm putting myself ahead. Of, I'm going to call you right now. I'm just kidding. No. <laughs> congratulations on the nomination. So happy for you. Judy, um, tell me what made this role different than anything else you've ever done. Mm, I feel like every role I do is different than everything else I've ever done. In my mind, they're all very different. Um, I, I liked this character. Her name is Kitty because she is, um, she's sort of dipping her toe into her own independence from, you know, being kind of uh, like a, a wife and a mom more than a woman. And I, I, you know, it's a supporting character, but I felt like that was the story I was trying to tell was that she towards the end is like finding herself a little bit. And I think if the story went on, if it was a TV show, I think she would find a lot of strength in uncle Frank and, um, and, and sort of use his, his story to, to discover who she is too. Lois, uh, along those, those lines, what made this role magical for you? You know, I think for Alan, it it was uh, related to uh, uh, whether an aunt or grandmother. I'm not sure. It's a, it's an aunt. Butch is an aunt in the in the play, um, and he remembered what it was like looking into that face as a little boy. He remembered glasses that were so thick. It, it was a, a bit scary to look at the eyes, um, and so that there was a a sense of in a way, that was the starting point of how this this old aunt is seen from a from a little boy. <laughs> um, she's 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 lived a a long, strict life, mostly, and uh, hasn't had much. Uh, Many byways, really. I mean, we don't know that for sure. If there was more story, we might find. But but the strictness and the inability to reach this right. this little boy, this grown man, you know. Yeah. I have a question for you both. And Lois, I'm going to start with you because what a career. I mean, East of Eden, I just revisited that recently. I mean, just a wonderful film starring with James Dean, of course. But the question is simple and it is to you. And, and Judy, I'll get to you in a second. What is it about showbiz that you absolutely love so much? You know, I was thinking a lot about how we do it all together. And that's the only way we can do it. And that's probably... That's not the only thing, but that is a very big thing. I remember rather young when I was sort of beginning and and thinking, oh, I have to look inside myself. And that's a very alone, a lonely thing. But then what I find there, I have to bring it out and bring it to all of us together. Wonderful answer. I love that. Judy, same question for you, because this film is so beautiful and it speaks to so many people on so many different levels. So I ask, uh, you know, what is it about entertainment? What is it about being in film that you absolutely love so much? Well, I love that you use the word showbiz, first of all, um, originally. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Like, uh, <laughs> um, I, uh, I hate to, to borrow from Lois's answer, but um, I think one thing that, that not working for eight months um, has taught me is, is how much I miss the people and, and being around people. And, and that's kind of what I think I like best about, about what, what I do is, is like, I find all my inspiration through the world and through being around other people and even strangers and on the subway and in coffee shops and, and being around my friends and their families. And I just think that that's what I miss. I miss us all together, all these like weird strangers coming together in this like weird location and telling the same story together, but through all of our own points of view and how almost every time it all sort of works out that we're telling the same story, but we're all coming from completely different times and ages and, and, and places. It's just a miracle. I'm seeing what a miracle it is. And, and you certainly, when you watch a movie like this, it's a small movie and it's a story about 
you know, a little thing, but it's a story about everything at the same time. Beautiful. Thank you both so much for your time. Thoroughly okay. enjoyed it. Mom's listening and thank you all. Hi, Stay Mom. safe. Mom, say hi. <laughs> there she is. She literally just screamed it. You all be careful and I'll see you soon, okay? Okay, be, be safe. Well. Thank you, Lois. Take care. Bye, Judy.